Well, we had some cooler temperatures recently, and what better way to warm up than with a bowl of ramen? It's time for food to go, and joining us with all the details is COO Hayato Otake and Director of Marketing and Ji Hong of Ramen Barrio. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Ohayou gozaimasu. Thank you for joining us. So tell us a little bit about Ramen Barrio. Um, so Ramen Barrio originated in Japan back in 2010, and since then, Ramen Barrio has opened about five locations back home in Japan. And they came to Waikiki, opened their first location in Waikiki, then they opened up Alamoana location, which is the one that is well known to all of us. And they um, decided to come back to Waikiki as Styx Asia. Um, ramen Barrio, um, they're very well known for traditional tonkatsu, tonkatsu st style ramen, as well as sukimen. And their broth is so much flavor. It's robust, intense flavor. Mm -hmm. And um, they're also known for their uh, th chewy noodles um, and really, really fresh ingredients. Amazing. So how does it feel to be back at Waikiki with this new location? Yeah, uh, I... <clears throat> exciting back to Waikiki. My business start uh, from Waikiki, same spot. Awesome. Yeah, um, I found a uh, customer uh, eating, smile, mm -hmm. and, and I'll take picture, and face-to-face, uh, -face, uh, familiar face, uh, say hello mm -hmm. again. Yeah, I'm so fun. That's awesome. And I was actually visiting you guys a few days ago, and there were a lot of people there, and they were all taking photos. So just like what you were saying, Chef, nice that you guys are back in Waikiki, and there's a lot of people that are already visiting the new location. So what do we have here this morning then, Chef? Uh, yes. Uh, this one, uh, our uh, favorite, my favorite, uh, Deluxe, Barrio Deluxe Ramen. Yes. Uh, it's the, uh, Mm. Uh, local people like the spicy, mm. the uh, spicy corn ramen. Oh. Yes, and uh, this one, uh, yeah, our most popular barrio egg ramen. Wow. Yes, and uh, this one, uh, spicy cilantro tsukemen. Uh, tsukemen is a new style of uh, ramen. And I just tried skimming for the first time with you guys a couple of days ago, but I don't think I tried the spicy one yet. So is that okay if I try this one? Yes. Awesome. And then are there any exclusive menu items for this new ramen barrio location that you can't find maybe in Japan or at the Alamoana location? Uh, oh, this one uh, only uh, Waikiki. Oh, okay. So these ones at the Waikiki location. Yes. Very nice. Let me dip this. Oh, we got long noodles. Skimming. And again, sometimes I... I can't handle spicy, but I think this will be good. Let me try to grab a napkin, actually, so I don't want to spill. Mmm. That's a thick, chewy uh -huh. noodle. Uh -huh. <laughs> Very good, though. So tell us, where can we find you then online? In person? Uh, yeah, definitely mm -hmm. on uh, visit our website at sticksasia.com or also Ramen uh, Barrio's website, barriohawaii.com. Um, Chef is very much well engaging via social media, mm -hmm. so you're more than welcome to follow him at Ramen Barrio Hawaii or at Sticksasia for updates and all the good stuff. Um, one good thing about our location is that we do offer parking validation mm -hmm. on the week weekdays from 5 p.m. to 10 on the weekends all day. Um, and awesome. speaking of updates, we are celebrating our one-year anniversary coming up in February 6th. So please come check us out. It'll be a month-long celebration. We're so happy that Robin Barrio is going to be joining us in this milestone. Awesome. Thank you so much for coming. And before we head off, I know we have all we have skimmin, we have ramen, but there's also amazing kimchi and also rice bowls that you can get too. So be sure to check them out. Again, they're at Al Moana now, Sticks Asia, which is an amazing food hall in Waikiki in downtown Honolulu by kind of by the Royal Hawaiian Center or Waikiki Shopping Plaza. Waikiki, Waikiki, Waikiki Shopping, Shopping Plaza. Plaza. Perfect. Sounds good. Thank you for joining us, guys. Thank you for Thank having you. us. Thank you.